Approximately 10 million pets are lost every year uh, because owners do not have a permanent means of identification to their pets. A tag on a collar could get lost or an address on a harness could get snagged on something and, and, and be gone forever. And so the key word here is permanence. And microchips provide us that level of permanence that we're looking for. And I'm so happy to be joined by Mila, Sebastian and Rosemary, who are joining us today to talk about microchips. How are you? Great, great today to Today is a very yeah. exciting day. This is fantastic. I'm very curious uh, how old Mila is. She's four years old. She's four years old, and is Mila microchipped? No, she isn't. Okay, all right. Well, this is important to establish, and that's not a bad thing at all, but I'm curious as to why we never got her microchipped. Well, there's a lack of uh, information, and right. I'm not really sure what the procedure she'd have to go through. I get it. There's a lot of myths out there, misconceptions about it. There are some people who actually believe that microchips involve surgery. So yeah. today is a very exciting day for her. You've kind of agreed to get Mila microchipped, right? Yes. All right, excellent. <laughs> Let's talk about what a microchip is first of all. A microchip simply is just a small transducer that emits a radio frequency that can be detected by a scanner. It just allows your dog to be identified in case of something happens. Now, Mila, are you ready? All right, well, I'm gonna scan the microchip itself, okay? And there is the number. Oh. This number right here is unique to Mila, okay? No other dog is gonna have this number. The microchip is constrained within a syringe. Now, when we do place this, she's gonna feel a little pinch, okay? Like getting, if you got your ear pierced or if she got a vaccine or something like that, okay? okay? Mila, do you think you're ready? <laughs> she's like, I don't know. <laughs> I think treats could convince me to be ready. Hi. She says, I'm already cautious. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we can just spin her around that direction. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. Beautiful. I'm going to have the microchip here, right? And I'm going to place the microchip between the loose skin between her shoulder blades. All right. Three, two, one. Oh, feel a little pinch. Done. OK? Now we're done. All right, Mila, I'm going to scan you. There it is. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's Mila's number. Good job, Mila. Yeah. All right, yeah. now, this is a big deal, but we're not done yet. This microchip right now, honestly, it's almost like just a fancy piece of jewelry beneath the skin. Why? Well, because we haven't done the second most important part, and that is register it. For all of you at home, if you already have a microchip, make sure you register the chip in the county where you're from, and also the most current contact information. Otherwise, they may be able to find your dog, but they may not be able to contact you. Listen, I want to thank you both for being here. Absolutely. Thank you thank so you. much. Yes. Thank, thank you, you so much. Me. Mila, thank you so much.